Eric is a very rare breed. I think that everybody that meets Eric is like, is this guy even real? She is just immensely kind. She's bubbly, she's open-hearted, she loves everyone who comes into contact with her and like makes friends wherever she goes. He is just so loving and caring and just connected to nature and to, you know, the earth and his family and his friends. And he goes out of his way just to make, sh make sure everybody feels safe and protected and loved. She's just like utterly sweet and caring and compassionate with the people around her. She's super generous. You know, she just, wherever she goes, she just lights up the room, so. imagine this moment standing at the altar marrying the man of my dreams uh, but since Jason Momoa was unavailable I had, <laughs> I had to get I had to see uh, I had to settle for the next best thing you well I, I know we decided we were gonna keep these short but I might have gone a little bit long so I had a lot to say about you <laughs> no. That's really not it. It's, oh, okay. No. <laughs> it's like, please. Please tell me that. My love. Well, we're finally here. The day we've spent two years dreaming about. And no, not the dreams where Jason Momoa <laughs> is giving you a sponge bath in the nude. The other ones. <laughs> Two words that I always use to describe what we have together, natural and effortless. With you, it's just easy. <laughs> we found each other, brought our two separate worlds together, and created this beautiful life for ourselves and our children. My greatest wish has always been to be with someone that I could connect with on every level, where our relationship was just natural and loving and could withstand anything that was thrown at it. I know there is no such thing as a perfect man, but I would say you're pretty damn close. <laughs> Being with you has granted all my wishes and so much more. You exceed my wildest dreams and surprise me every day with something new to love about you. To know you is to love you, and I'm positive everyone here would agree. I feel incredibly lucky that you love me. I utterly cherish you, sweetheart. That word cherish is one that I feel like I only had a surface understanding of before you. I love you so deeply. <laughs> and I will always move heaven and earth to make you happy. I think that our differences are what, a big part of what makes our relationship so beautiful. I accept you exactly as you are, and you do the same. You are the most incredible, strong-hearted, kindest, open-minded, resilient, and humblest women I have ever met. I have always believed that the quality of a person's friendships are a reflection of the person that they are, and I'm endlessly impressed with the love generosity and compassion that you put into the world. I vow to always be your biggest supporter and number one fan, to compromise with you, instead of four cats, maybe two or three. 
<laughs> I promise to love your children as my own. They are a beautiful extension of you, and since you have my heart, so do they. I vow to be your friend always and to never get, forget the love that we share. I promise to love, honor, and cherish you through all life's adventures. Wherever we go, we go together. I promise to pause our shows when you fall asleep 10 minutes into them. <laughs> love you in sickness and health, richer or poorer, clothed or naked. <laughs> Always let you have a bite of my meals, even when you're supposedly not hungry. Tolerate your murder shows if you put up on my home improvement shows. <laughs> I also promise you that I will always listen to your needs, and I will do whatever I can to meet them. I will always accept every part of you unconditionally, just like you do for me. And that I will always put the health of our marriage at the top of the list, and do my part to keep our love strong. I will dream big with you, support you, adventure with you, grow with you, and work with you to make our dreams reality. Thank you, my beautiful bride, for standing with me forever and always. The secret is to wake up every day next to the person you love and think to yourself, I definitely got the better half of this deal. <laughs> that resonates with me today because every morning since I met you, I woke up with that exact same feeling. I feel incredibly honored that I get to be your wife and that I get the better half of this deal. <laughs> I love you so very much. I love you. <laughs> Do you, Melissa and Eric, take each other as husbands and wife? We do. <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. You can mark this moment with a wee kiss. A wee one. <laughs> Oh!